We are back. My next guest is a most imaginative and talented gentleman who created the famous puppets who will be featured in a TV special at 8 o'clock tomorrow night called The Muppet Show. Would you welcome, please, Jim Henson. <laughs> Hello, Jim. Oh, it's nice to meet time. you. Hello. He's nice got to go on the best dress list, you know that. Oh, yeah, you like yeah. My, my threads. Oh, yeah. I love yeah. my threads. <laughs> <laughs> That's Dr. Teeth, huh? How are yeah, you, Doctor? Yeah, good. Oh, yeah. Good to see you. <laughs> nice to see you. <laughs> you feel Made so... the big time, didn't I? Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Boy. In the big room. Oh, yeah. Yeah. How, how would you describe your music? What, what is that? Is that rock or jazz? Oh, it's or... uh, it's uh, like catastrophe music. <laughs> <laughs> The towering inferno with bongo drums. You know? Yeah. 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 Do, uh, do you get a lot of chicks now that, you know, most rock stars have the groupies uh, now yeah, that you're a big you star? Know, Does well, that being to... a puppet, it's uh, sort of different. You know? <laughs> <laughs> the head of my fan club is Nangora Sweater. You know? <laughs> Comes out of Dubuque, Iowa. You know, she's really fuzzy, though, man. You know? <laughs> oh, yeah. Dig that fuzz. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> where, where, did, where did you get your name, uh, the Dr. Teeth? What, uh, my gold tooth there. Oh, I see, right in the front. See, in there, yeah. Got three gold records melted down in there. <laughs> <laughs> melted them down and stuck them in my mouth. Yeah. Yeah. Who, who's going to be on the special tomorrow night with, with Dr. Teeth? Well, let's see. Shall I answer that? Sure. I, uh, just... Sure, go ahead. Yeah, no, it doesn't matter to me, man. Yeah. Now, we've got uh, sort of an unusual line of characters. Yeah. We've got uh, uh, the homicidal maniac and the San right. Francisco earthquake. We've got Mount Rushmore and the seven deadly sins. Mount Rushmore and the seven deadly sins. <laughs> did you, did Fantastic. You, yeah, crazy. And my group, which is the Electric Mayhem. <laughs> <laughs> did you start this as a kid, huh? fooling oh, around with puppets? And... Well, I started sort of just out of high school. <clears throat> right. And, uh, and then I had it's a, a whole new departure from just the hand puppets. You've given them a whole new, a whole new dimension, and yeah. some of the things you've done, where you do the visual pieces of film with the with the characters, really. Uh, yeah, well, I, I've worked incredible. in television a long time, and I enjoy television. Itself. It has a lot of uh, effects that you can do that you can't do yeah. live, right? You can you can combine the the, the film and so forth. Mm -hmm. Where's our old friend Kermit? Is Kermit oh, around? Have, Maybe we can call on around. Kermit. We can do. Do we want to do a break first? Yes. Then we'll come back and we'll talk with Kermit a while. Sure. Okay. All right. Sorry, we'll take a break here. If you just join us, we're talking with Diane Carroll, Jim Henson and some of his friends, and uh, Dan Rowan will join us, and Larry Beezer and uh, Norman Fell a little bit later on. Uh, and here's my old friend Kermit. Uh, Hi there. Hi. <laughs> Hello, Kermit. Hello out there. Yeah, it's nice to be here. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to be on the special tomorrow night, uh, Kermit? No. You're not on no, the special? No, you know, they gave me one lousy line. <laughs> you know, no, I, I'm not going to work that show. <laughs> what do you think? Maybe you're getting a little too old or something like that? You're the, you're the oldest of the group, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. You know, I, was, uh, I, I was one of the first guys. Yeah. A long time ago. Yeah. You know, a what? lot of thanks I get, you know? <laughs> what do you How do young guys get it? You know, these young, long-haired rock kids yeah. playing what? that lousy music? What do you think of Dr. Tooth's music? I hate it. <laughs> Terrible stuff. Yeah, yeah. Don't care for it at all. No, huh? frogs don't dig stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> No, no rock, huh? Just uh, no, old-fashioned no. music. Yeah. Right. What kind of a part do you play in the special? They give you one line. I got one lousy line. That's. that's yeah, I'm sorry about that. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's, uh, it's nothing. It's how's a nothing show, you know. No. Yeah. How's, how's your love life? What? <laughs> how's my love life? How's your love life? Listen, I, I work on Sesame Street. You don't ask. You don't ask a frog questions like that. <laughs> You wouldn't I, ask Cap Captain Kangaroo how's no, his sex no, life? No, I wouldn't. Yeah, can you imagine that? You're absolutely right. That, that, that was wrong. That was wrong of me. I should, yeah. should, shouldn't have done that. Sure. Well, how's your, how's your health? Is that the same question? Uh, is your health all right? That's okay. You're feeling well, then? Yeah, it's got a bad throat, you know. Yeah. What, what, do you, what do you take for it? It's got a, I've got a person in my throat. <laughs> Joke, that's, a, that's a frog joke, joke. yes. Yeah, real big with all the frogs out there. I'll bet it is. Yes. Oh, yeah, sure. What, can I ask you a question? What, what's, sure. what's Kermit made of? Well, this is, it's a kind of a fleecing fabric. The, uh, the first Kermit was made out of... Uh, <laughs> punch there, aren't you? The, uh, the first Kermit I made... Uh, 
I made a, the first Kermit out of a spring coat of my mother's. Mm -hmm. you know, which, and a couple of ping pong balls. I see. For the eyes. We still I use see. ping pong balls. <laughs> I <up> don't. <laughs> Humiliating. Yes, you see, Kermit, see, Kermit seems very sensitive. Very, very yeah, sensitive frog. He got his feelings hurt because he wasn't working this show. Like, yeah. What do frogs do when they're, I mean, when they're not frogging? I mean, what do they, do they have any hobbies or, you know, sport, no. sports or anything like no. that? Doing no, no. Oh. No, frogs, we just sit around. Yeah. You sit in the swamps, you sit in the mud, you know. Yeah. Sit there. That's what frogs do. <laughs> Everybody knows that. <laughs> I'm sitting here talking to a dumb frog. Thanks a I'm, lot. I'm Thanks sorry, I'm sorry. I'm awfully sorry about that. He just alienated all the frogs out there. Yeah. It's okay, he, frogs. He didn't mean it. Hey, I thank you for coming tonight. It's always a great pleasure. You see, the, the special is at 8 o'clock tomorrow. Right. And uh, I'll, I'll catch it because you, uh, you're you really brilliant with this stuff. Uh, you know, it's, it's okay. <laughs> and Kermit, Don't my apologies. Yeah. I'm sorry about the sesame tree. Thank you, Jim. Nice thank you, Kermit. It's funny where the fantasy starts and the, you get so caught up, you get caught up. I'm sitting here talking to a frog. Yeah. And you don't look at him at all. You just I'm look at the animal. I'm talking to the frog and the frog gets steamed. Yes. <laughs> apologizing to a puppet. <laughs> you must know when you're ready for the home. <laughs> Dan Rowan will come out in a moment and we have Larry Beezer with us who's a young new comedian and Norman Fell. And we will take this brief interruption. Oh, this is our new sponsor. I got to mention a while ago, Ron, too. Wonderful lighter. Nice to have him with us. <laughs>